How do we look? We look good? Now, nah, we do all this, isn't it? We move regardless. I know, only kind of one of the You know, it's me, just my manicure. <laughs> yeah, yay! Hey guys, let's get to the video. A pair of jeans, a shirt or two. We didn't pack as if we weren't and going back. Doesn't matter if it's true I've got a feeling love will give us what we like The world is waiting up The world is waiting half a step beyond our door Yo, welcome back to my channel and thank you very much guys for clicking on this video So as the title suggests We'll just be going a bit deep into the feminine issues Bah, where do we start? Oh my god God, I don't have my notebook and this is where I've written all my things. But we are going to do this. We are going to hack this. Because you know what, guys? On my social platform, that is Instagram right here. If you haven't followed me, kindly do so. Go and follow me because that is where all the juice, all the tea, all the... Mm, everything. That's where it goes on. So, I posted a picture on my social platform. That's my Instagram. Whereby... Eh, what are these? butter so we are in the nature guys so forgive any noise you hear from the background oh, but that's too much so no okay guys so we are going to do this regardless on the social platform i said i i want a woman out there who's suffered so much about concert con <laughs> guy about contraceptives yani you've used this you've used this you've used this but every single time it reacts so adversely with your body to a point where you get uncomfortable because it can really really get uncomfortable so on my platform i said after i make this video this is when i'm going to be giving out one persona and you know what i feel like i will get to change a lady out there like i feel like i will get a chance to change a lady's life out there because for the persona contraceptive monitor guys you use it till end of times <laughs> you get like this is a contraceptive that you will use yani mpaka maya izako zioze you yani till your eggs yani they can no longer drop that egg this is when you will stop using this thing because that means you will not be able to get pregnant anymore so this is how much i feel like i'm going to impact a lady's life because i have just given her a lifetime solution for me that feels great honestly it does feel great i am going to be sharing just a bit of my experience with one or two things that i've used before this all this happens because there's an increase of estrogen in your body this is the hormone that determines all these thingy things that go on in the female body so the common effects on this p2 i'm going to talk about what i have used that is the whole point of me talking about the persona contraceptive monitor so i have come not come across i have used a p2 before that i have used the poprovera shot that's the injection that's taken depending on the months you want two months three months six months and now okay wait the the number one then nearly join you nikiwa two because the times are classic some kifunzo adolescents you know and that's mostly a condom and then the other thing that i'm currently using and have been using for the last two good years without any alteration without anything else is a persona monitor so aside the persona monitor aside the condom the depo provera shot and the, the p2 and the depo provera you find that uh, most of the common side effects are excessive bleeding like you bleed past the normal days of your periods that you're supposed to bleed who wants that honestly mimi kama period zangu zenyewe enyewe zinafukanga mali nasikia guy nikane za zikat short ebu imagine it's a heavy flow it's excess and it's going more days okay mimi it's uncomfortable for me i don't know about you that's uncomfortable for me so the other thing uh we have is the depo provera shot the depo provera also makes kind of makes this because with my experience i got a three months injection <laughs> let me not lie people regardless okay we move regardless <laughs> okay guys so 
as I was saying, when women just sit around, we'll j the, the topic contraceptive is going to come up. Okay, it's going to come up. And most ladies, wana chochana wana ambia. Now, you know, I've been using this. This is good. I have been using this. This is good. I have been using this. This is good. Now, me, as Shiro, I go and experiment because Jerry said she uses this and it's good. So, I think it's also going to be good for me. So, there is no best contraceptive for women as in you get me there is no nikama venya you can say um panadol is best for headaches like for severe headaches you get like we can all take it if we have severe headaches no that is not the case with contraceptives there is no common contraceptive for all of us no let's start from there uh next point is I think if you're getting all these adverse effects happening to your body because at Ileo you've tried a coil, tomorrow Siju you've tried what? You've tried what? What do we call this? All these words are going away. <laughs> so what do we call this? So some some of these side effects just come around because contraceptive at times prescribed by your gynecologist or your doctor, they prescribe it because of your Ge genetic history you know genetic history some of the contraceptive you're prescribed to is because maybe your family ukonyoma they've had cases of diabetes they've had cases of cancer so did you know that all these hereditary diseases can actually cause all these side effects happening to your body because you did not find out about all this before you started using whatever you're using hiya but not to worry i am here to solve all your problems i am here to give you this persona here it's just here just look here this persona is here to solve your problems yani till you 45 yani till ugonge menopause ndi yani utakuna tumia tu kitu moja lifetime investment anyway let's get to it my first time using contraceptives was in my second year in university drum rolls yes so that's when and yeah my boyfriend back then brought me a p2 but to my younger selves and to this my maybe my small sisters my small sisters from other mothers like just there my the younger me let me just tell you p2 go mess you <laughs> p2 go mess your life sour because we tend to misuse p2 right here again so squeezing me on ambaka this it has tokeyed another one siju generic huh ati mbaka you go choose no give me the generic one generic ama si generic you are misusing it you should read that car box you see that car box okay i don't know if we won't read it you go read it for yourself it's written it's an emergency pill yani you should say emergency ni le for one one yani it's an emergency pill it's used in cases of incest cases of rape so this is what is administered to you during the 72 hours when you're taken to hospital after a rape case you are misusing it yani ini emergency pill so if you really like taking the pills take the daily pills but p2 huh, sisters and brothers higher so what a took for emergency pill it has around or even higher like chances of it backfiring when you use it like a contraceptive 20 percent ah that's easy did i did you did you hear that point chances of p2 backfiring is usually missy daktari and i am not here to tell anyone to just do whatever i'm saying but i'm just here to tell you that you should dig more before you ingest anything into your body yes like p2 just literally backfired and the baby was there yani no likunyo on time but you know what you and your halia life do not move regardless <laughs> Sawa, so, uh, to move regardless. But usiseme siku kwambia P2 ikibako. Sawa, so, uh, it has yani chances zake za kubackfire are very high. Sawa. So, uh, 
Aya, ah, yeah, so we've covered P2. I'm talking about what I've used. Aya, ah, yeah, let's go to number two. The Popovera short. Wait, I remember this time, Kwanza, when I got it. <laughs> Uh, I think I had just broken up with my boyfriend. I don't know. Ama, we were on just on the verge of breaking up with my boyfriend. So I was like, hmm. Lakini, peer pressure got to me. And what I'm saying is, yeah, my friends were like, you know, this is good. Yani, there is no stress. You know, you don't take pills. You don't do this. Nini, mimi. Nika songa na peer pressure. Iko api? Tuende, tuendete. You know, I went and got that injection. Some days later, see I went home. See me, I'm just normal. See, I'm just at home. Like one, two, three, one, two, three, that, you know. Hey, I bleed. I bleed. I bleed. Hey, I bleed and bleed. Yani, I bled for over one week. Then it got uncomfortable because I was like, okay, my periods are over, but I'm still bleeding. Nasile ku bleed atile. Ni kama apana, I am bleeding. So I decided, Mimi, I'm free. I'm I'm very free with my mom. So and I guess all of us, all of us feminines, we should all be free with our moms, cause that is a woman who will go through hell and heaven just to fix everything in your life. Aya, we all know that. Okay, big up, mama, big up. So, um, I went to her and I was like, Hey, mom, you know, Mimi, kuna venye. I did this and this. I got this injection, and now it's going wrong on me. Hey, she was like, okay, fine, that's normal, this happens, different women react differently to different contraceptives, and don't worry, it's not like a permanent thing, uh, you know, aya, sawa, we move regardless, <laughs> we move regardless, new jinga, aya, sawa, let me stop it, <laughs> so she said, aya, ingia kwa gari, let's go, so she took me to, she has a friend, who's, and who's a doctor, so we just went to the nearby Kahosi, who's just actually, very nearby our house so and she gave me a very tiny capil and i just took it and the next day all this was gone it's like it never even happened so just tell me a lady out there who's not be able to tell her mom or is not be able to get uh the right treatment for all this to stop ama yani me my question is why even go for treatment and it's something that you can just prevent. You get you you just put in a tidawa kwa mwili and more and more and more and more. Yeah, just avoid it. You get just avoid it. That's what I'm just trying to tell a lady out there. You can avoid all these things one to three by knowing really what works for your body and what does not work for your body. And if you are a lady who enyewe all this is in a kukata, but you really have to work with one thing or another. I'm just here to tell you that. Took a swing at a wrecking ball and that cafe of university i got lucky and i met my husband to be my fiance and before we even met hi baby <laughs> so before we actually even met the first thing he took into consideration was i would want a future with you you know like how are you taking care of yourself as a woman? I want you as a package of healthy. He was caring enough to just introduce me to what I'm just introducing to you guys. That was two years down the line from now. It's called a persona contraceptive monitor. As you can see it right here, this is the whole package. And this is how it looks. It contains of a small monitor, which I would tend to term it as a small computer that actually records your data, gives you accurate information. And why I'm saying accurate information? Because you test it like a pregnancy. You know, like how you test in the morning with your first urine early in the morning this is the same way you do it with the persona contraceptive monitor as you can see the stick right here actually almost looks like one of a pregnancy stick you know uh so you basically just pee on it you know you go toilet nini uh -huh, uh -huh. exactly so after you do that after you pee on it you insert the stick inside the monitor and the monitor will give you either a red day or a green day so this is what it has to offer on the table every single day of your life a green day and a red day using this purchasing this winning this 
your cycle has to be more than 25 days and not more than 32 days for you to be able to use a persona contraceptive monitor so if your periods vary at times they are at 22 days at times they are at some certain days you can't at any point use a persona monitor because the persona monitor right here cannot be able to predict your cycle so in these chances it might give you a red day where it's supposed to be green or it might give you a green day where it's supposed to be red so in these cases you are not allowed to use a persona contraceptive monitor next point about the contraceptive monitor <laughs> you start using your contraceptive for your first month the first month you will use 16 sticks this is because you and the monitor are trying to you know you are trying to get acquainted to one another for it to be able to predict exact or for it to be able to give you an accuracy and do you read my lips accuracy in future so after the first month you use 16 sticks and then best part is the second month third month fourth month second year fifth year the rest of your life you will use eight to ten sticks a month by saying 16 sticks i mean you'll test 16 times in your first month of using the persona contraceptive monitor then after that mine is eight days i've not seen any that goes past 10 days so the second month you'll only test eight times a month and then the rest of the month actually the rest yeah it's the rest of the month you actually get green days so you'll actually get only eight days eight days eight single days in a month where it's a red day and this is where the monitor tells you your chances okay the the eight days include your ovulation two days of ovulation but in this also eight days the persona tells you your rate of getting pregnant is um and whatever i just told you those are the major 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 things that you need to know about the persona contraceptive monitor it's natural that's the way of life yani it's 96 percent reliable here to advocate or say one cons one contraceptive is better than the other one i'm here to say that you should really find out what's best for your body before you really ingest it in your body and for people who like the natural way of life i am here to advocate for a persona monitor like it's a lifetime investment the african society has made it look like Yani ni embarrassing kuongelelea sex with your parents. You know, that is what I don't get what this is. Because, enyewe, mimi ile time nilijua about sex, ama nilijua about contraceptive, ni very different than this generation right now. You know, so na just isi tulikuwa ile ya, Anita, Anita wangue. You remember, like, squeezy, eh, wamlambe, wamnyon. Like, you get, <laughs> these two generations are way part as in they are getting to know things so fast they want to experiment so fast they want to go to the world so fast so i think you had to really slow down their rate to kimbizane now we just keep up yeah so we just tell them about all these contraceptives and the rest i think okay that's my thing if you start using a persona kindly never at any point mix with any contraceptive yani never never ever ever mix it with another contraceptive because utakuja wanza kusema oh michelle alisemanga oh akasemanga you know alisema then because it backfired alisema alisema oh kukaenda aya kukaenda ndio hiyo kumeenda so don't mix it with any other contraceptive and with that said guys i think you should realize whatever you're putting in your body is is or can cause long time effects to you as a lady so i would like to urge a younger self out there or even not even a younger self an older self or where you can just pick up from from where you are and just find out really what you use in your body because not everything is meant for you okay so with that said guys i'll see you on my next vlog so thank you very much and make sure to subscribe like and share
that means a lot guys because i can't be doing these vlogs without you thank you very much again for the support you guys are shining and i'm going to end this by saying live to your fullest like you can see this place is empty oh like it's empty <laughs> this is how serious life can get it can change in a blink of a second everything can go wrong everything can go right so live to your fullest Live to your fullest and don't forget tomorrow is never certain. So till next time guys, I'll catch you on my next vlog. Thank you very much. Tschüssi.